Will we finally see the upbeat kill that we've been win waiting for? We saw it yesterday, but uh, that's besides the point. All I'm saying, there's a clear favorite here, but uh, yeah, deleted. Absolutely no chance. That is well deserved. Like, how, how, why are you going off stage like that when you have no recovery? Like, that's you're asking to lose this stock. But stadium, find this pick. This is the best stage in the game. Especially because like Jay is not ch not not playing games. He's just straight going Zelda. Doesn't want to play games like that. Yeah. So this is not going to be a real close game. Uh. Oh. It's just me here. <laughs> okay, well, we are seeing some. <laughs> we're seeing some off, a lot of offstage gameplay. We are indeed. We are indeed. That's that's one Mainly of the indie's best uh, couple of traits is his offstage game. But his recovery isn't the greatest, which is tough. What do you mean? It's uppy. <laughs> I mean, true, but like vertically, <laughs> vertically, Bandana D kind of struggles. For what happened? You really up a stock. What happened? Um, down B. Okay. Yeah. Still so she and then lost. <laughs> no, 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 no. The opposite Aura of what we want to see. Okay. Or I used down B and it killed because Zelda like. <laughs> oh, F smash. Yeah, oh, that kills. Oh, yep. And we're even. This is true. Ah, uh, up smash no. city. Teleporting platform, nice. Yeah. True. Instead of just kind of looking for some sort of hit here. Multi hit gets interrupted. Back here is out of hit stun. Looking for the side bees. Good wait from Aura. Both players playing pretty patiently. Falls out of the F smash. Yep. Yep. Hit by a tilt. Jay's Jay, making Jay this work. Trying to catch, oh my god. Jay's just trying to catch an aggressive option. Yep. Oh, Absolutely. big damage here. Oh. Still going. Still going somewhere. That was somewhere. a good trade from Jade. Uh, up yeah. a full stock. Mm -hmm. Uh, gets out of the corner. Oh. And... Big damage coming up, probably. Oh, that's good. Oh, no. Jumps right into oh. the into the up <sighs> Weird up I think that was meant to be a side B upwards. Bro, who cares? That looks like what it back, throw. Throw. back throw done. Yeah, that's it. Dead? Yeah. All right. Easily. Like, that, that was game one. Yep. Convincingly, like even even with how weird the beginning of the game was, at the very end it was like, yeah, Jay just held it down. Yeah. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff. I don't know where or even goes, because I feel like you lose on every stage. Yeah. Remember route? Yeah, I guess. I, I guess. Ooh. Maybe. Yeah, fair enough. Or just kind of throwing stuff out to kind of wall out uh, DJL here. He is desperate, so it makes sense. That's true. Just in general, like not even in game, but just in general, he's desperate. So it makes sense why he would try something a little more off the beaten path. Oh, double oh. side B! Oh, dang! That was that was that was nice. I like it. That's a, that's a really nice. That's a hold forward moment. Oh, misses the grab. Oh, misses the grab. It's the up B. That's he. He has been doing those little cancels on the platform with up B. I see. Back air, not yet. They working for him too. Yep. Oh, down B, catching the recovery onto stage and or up clean stock cut. and instantly loses it. And now, Ooh. it's like when you take a skill in ultimate and then you just get back aired off yeah. the platform. Yeah. That's kind yeah. of just like you have to be really aware. When your opponent has that, a yeah, that, 
that is a perfect example of just respectfully that's the mix of like do you shield when they're trying to be invincible or do you like air like spot dodge do you bait out a grab what do you do when yeah. someone's invincible that's always the mix of do you go to ledge uh, that's way many ways you can do, do it. jump yeah a lot of people will try and surprise you off of the recovery platform for the angel platform so if mm -hmm. you can kind of like just bait out something and force them to waste their invincibility like that then you can be pretty successful with keeping yeah. stocks. That makes sense. And so, well, that was that was a good opportunity, but he didn't do anything with yeah. it. Yeah, I think maybe the recognition not quite there yet. That is true. A B gets on the platform the up, up air. there. Takes control on North's favor. Gets good about wait. Even. Good waiting, but gets that was the, the worst. Side. That was oh my god, Brain Broth saved him. Oh? Oh, almost. Almost. And almost I ended the episode. Double fire again. That's rough. Jade really just controlling the set. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. And right now, Aura looking for. Oh, wh why is he going off stage? That was. You're so he's, lucky. He didn't yeah, get he's lucky he didn't get like punished more for the. I'll be even honest. harder. Like, oh, clean. Doesn't Not enough up stage there. to be able to run in and up air. I'm actually surprised that like, okay, that's a good shield. I was gonna say like, I feel like uh, Jade should punish the approaches more. I feel like Jade's playing this really passive. It was working out. but like, the game plan looks yeah. good. The default game plan looks good, but. I feel like you should be, I feel like Jade could be more aggressive and beat him even harder. Like I played when I play Aura Friends, I just literally just go aggressive and he folds immediately. Mm. Wait. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Alright, a little bit of a Alright, good air dodge. Got some solid damage on. Could be climbing his way back into this. All back throw, yeah. Yeah, clean. Not the best DI either. Or on last talk, has to make some stuff go, go his way here. There's one move that can make it go his way. <laughs> <They> don't, <laughs> <laughs> bro. We're serious. It's he could spin his spear for Uppy. We talk. We that was the only thing we said for like all three of Aura's sets last uh, last stream yesterday. <laughs> it was so yeah. dumb. Uh -huh. Up air will kill. We also did this. We also did the Nintendo clap during the first set. <laughs> True. True. It's, it's this crazy how... Oh, X, oh, that that no DI almost killed him. You saw yeah. that, right? Yeah. It's crazy. He almost went to the side straight guy. Oh, is he oh, going to put no, it on? No, oh, nothing. no. Yeah, nothing. Ah. Zelda up is pretty hard to contest. No, yeah, no. You kind of just have to air dodge it. Not even air dodge. You just wait for, her, for the Zelda to land. Yeah. Like, just, puff, just be away from it. her. And... Yeah. Mm, game. Sweet spot. Is Chris how every time Retro talks, his mic gets worse? <laughs> what? What? Every time Retro talks, the mic quality just dropped 5%. <laughs> oh. Okay. Baller, I'll say this right now. I don't think you have any room to be to say that sort of stuff. His, my mic sounds way better. I don't know what you're talking about. Your mic has historically been better and far, far worse. Mm -hmm. And multiple instances. Yeah, and I don't know which version <laughs> version of the update I'm at right now, but uh, that's besides the point. Yeah. Anyway, Aura starting this off with the lead. It's a way zero to sixty. <laughs> Bro, I hear it. It got five percent worse. What? Oh. <laughs> I swear. Now next next time is gonna sound like fucking an eight bit SNES game. Eight Yo, bit? Wait, did you say 8-bit SNES? <laughs> bro, that's, that's what 16-bit, bro. You're right, you're right, I'm sorry. You know those tw like, tw games where like they say 16, but it's actually 8, and it's like, like I call, I'd call those 12-bit games, but they just lie to you. Like, it's like a bootleg game, like a Soldier Boy console. I, I guess, yeah. Shout out to the Soldier Boy console. True. This is... Fun fact, the Soldier Boy console is the official console of SSF2. It's true, we're all playing on Soldier Boy. No. Wait, it's retro. <laughs> <laughs> Does he know? Does he know? Does he know? That's the crazy. 
anymore. Like, my man is just, just burning. Right now, his headphones being cooked right now. That's why it sounds bad. Bro, got it cooking what? up in the oven. The headphones in the oven. <laughs> oh, cross up. Yeah. You kind of just have to hold shield there and hold the entire F smash. Yeah, right now, right now, my, uh, uh the, the whole, uh, I don't know what gender Jade is. Uh, they, but, uh, they, them. They, okay. Uh, bro, they out here just breaking ankles right now. True. Just, just right now, playing, uh, playing basketball and out here just, just crossing up on people. Oh, desperate down B. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. oh, went for the double dip, not able to get it. Why is Aura not punishing me? Aura is playing too timid. Yeah, Aura is playing is winning, very but... defensively. See, this is this is a thing I want. When my advice is, when you want to get good, just play really aggressive. Because ninety percent of people when they first start don't know how to beat aggression. Yeah. In this in this game player, at least, I can I can see it. Like when the, when most of the players who just start are really bad at handling being aggressive. That's why oh. I can just. That's why when I'm, even though I'm not that good, I can just play aggressive and just like stop people who aren't that great and get like three stock them because they just don't know how to be aggressive options. That like, 90% play... lead we saw is gone. No, it's not. That's a zero, exactly. Because that all happened because Jade knows how to be aggressive and to break people when like they don't know how to close out stops. That's the important thing. It's, but here's the thing is obviously when you play against the really good players, they know how to be aggression by just like, oh, holding back. Reading an approach and then grabbing, or reading an approach and then maybe doing like a, like some sort of dash attack or some sort of like combo. You know what I mean? They're like, like if you get something like Prol, for example, he waits for an approach and then just like, like he'll get a grab and then some sort of, like a sort of like down throw or maybe a cargo throw or something like that. You know what I mean? Like he'll do some sort of punish off of the fact that you're approaching too much. Yeah. Or even someone like. Uh, someone like JMI, for example, like he can't just play aggressive and just hold forward because he plays Bowser. He doesn't have the fast buttons, so he has to wait for the point to make a mistake or the point to do like an obvious approach. They know how to beat aggression because they're smart enough and know how they know how to play against aggr aggression. When a, when a player like Or, for example, uh, no disrespect, but it, it, they don't know how to beat that because. Yeah, I I get what you're saying for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, back throw incoming. Dead. Yeah. There we go. This is the tournament stock for Aura right here. It is. He does have the opportunity to turn this around, get himself on the board. Last stock situation for both. But if Aura can't really get anything going on the offensive end, I'm not sure what this is going to go like. Yeah. I don't like his chances that much. Like, he's had really good low percent combos, but he can't just he just can't uh, close out the stock. Oh, oh my gosh! Yeah, no, he's very close to dying here. Yeah, again, very close. I think a good solid smash attack or two will do it here. F smash! That's oh. not it. Oh, get some w with the that's tracking, dead. and that's it. Because he didn't use the one move. Yep. So that's going to be a 30 and a handshake for, for Jade. Yep. Aura out at 13th, and that's your masquerade of 13th placers. Aura, Nibble, uh, El Birdbrain, and Mooncrept. Good stuff to all those fellas. But that's going to be it for their tournament.